the moment in 2014 when Leah Kalangula became Miss Uganda. The farmer turned beauty queen had to deal with a lot of negativity. On social media, Ugandans said she's not beautiful enough. But she ignored the negativity and in so doing, won the hearts of Ugandans. And she wants other girls in the country to learn from that. When it comes to families, the girls need to be empowered from the start. They need to be raised in a way that, you know, they believe in themselves. They believe they can do things. They need to be given a chance to do different things. Leah has since swapped the catwalk for her mushroom and poultry farm. Her critics didn't like that she has an agricultural background, but she's used that to her advantage. There's nothing wrong with that. It's, it's a job. Every job is important in its way. So if someone despises a farmer, yet they eat food every day, then they have the problem, not me. So it kept me going, I should say. And all this negative feedback was, it was all, you know, pushing me into a positive direction because it opened up so many opportunities for me. Leah uses her experiences when giving talks to young girls. She also gives modeling lessons for that extra bit of confidence. And uh, the other thing I'm, I'm doing about modeling is there are some young people that come to me every Tuesday uh, at home in the evening to do some modeling classes. Well, they always contact me, so I figured why not? I mean, if someone wants to start, wants to learn how to walk, if I can do that, why can't I teach them? Leah firmly believes in women's rights and the importance of getting girls into school. But the inspiration goes both ways. Leah says when she meets some of the girls that look up to her, they too inspire her to be a better role model who won't stop at anything to achieve her dreams. Isabel Nakiria, CCTV, in Kampala.